Immunotherapy based on CAR T cells is an emerging opportunity for patients with uh, acute leukemia, with refractory or relapsed uh, disease, uh, which are uh, uncurable for the moment, uh, with standard therapy and uh, sometimes also with the transplantation. Uh, so uh, CAR T cells represent a good opportunity to offer uh, to, to these patients. And uh, in this frame, we are going to uh, currently uh, do a phase one, two trial in our center with the, this cytokine inducer killer cell, chick cells. <clears throat> and in this frame, one of the challenges is to uh, uh, understand how actually this uh, CAR T cell medicinal product uh, actually work and how we can improve the um, efficacy and the safety of this product. In this view, we, uh, we would like to address, uh, uh, let's say, four points. One is the uh, accurate characterization of the pre-infusion product. Secondly, is to uh, characterize uh, the CAR T cells, immunological profile and kinetics, and accurately uh, measure minimal residual disease with high sensitive and specific method, and uh, to, um, to monitor immune B and T cell reconstitution in the patient. So to do this, uh, we um, we are going to take advantage of uh, in our in our study to be involved in a um, European uh, project called INCAR, uh, in which uh, they are included uh, some uh, uh, leading center in Europe currently doing uh, different CAR T cell uh, therapy trials and. Uh, the, the main objective of this project, supported by different uh, several charities in uh, UK, in Italy and in Spain, is to uh, improve understanding of the biology of these CAR T cells, improve in manufacturing of this uh, 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 biological medicinal product, and improve the knowledge and the technique on how to monitor residual disease, uh, immuno B and T reconstitution, and uh, CAR T cells profiling. So, at uh, the advantage of this uh, um, of this network is that we are able to compare different platform manufacturing platform of CAR T cells different product including vector design and characteristics of these uh, of these different cars and different clinical trial so we will be able to improve the knowledge of uh, uh, the nature and the functionality of this car t cell and the microenvironment in which they work uh, thanks to the collaboration in this network Minimal residual disease is one of the challenge in this, uh, in this uh, work, in this project. And uh, um, mm, this is a very important point because uh, during the uh, follow-up of this uh, treated patient with CAR T cell, it's very important to monitor the level of response, individual response to the therapy. And uh, actually, uh, uh, flow cytometry, offer a good opportunity to do this, uh, this uh, assessment. But anyway, uh, we need a strong uh, standardization of the method. And in this sense, we are uh, in, this, in, in this project taking advantage of our uh, network in uh, Euroflow, which is a, a European consortium, scientific consortium, uh, with the aim to standardize uh, the diagnostics of uh, uh, hematological malignancies by flow cytometry. And uh, thanks to this collaboration, we are going now to introduce in this CAR T cell network an advanced method of flow cytometry with uh, unique uh, uh, 
multicolor panel able to dissect in one tube, in one single analytical session, all the parameters, such as minimal residual disease, CAR T cells, and immune reconstitution of the patient. This is just starting, but uh, we are going to validate uh, in collaboration with uh, the University of Salamanca, Professor uh, Alberto Orfao.